happen. Well, hello there, folks. I guess I'm uh, doing the intro right now. I guess I'm... Can you shut the <laughs> fuck up? <laughs> um, well, it's a new week. We're back with Baddest of the Bands here. Yeah, we are. We, uh... This must be what bums you we need to, to raise money. Security jacket. Uh, for our Battle of the Bands. To fix the fun machine. Yep. Uh, let's see. Apparently, whoever... Remember, we got this thing in our inventory. We have a Contest lot of form. shit. Yeah. Take out that cheese whip. Take it out. I don't know if we can no use it here. Way. Nope. What? No, it's not usable here. That's um, stupid. We got this contest form. If you will recall, uh, if whoever takes the coolest album picture, a limousine, will come and spend the day with us. Oh, a limousine? Yeah. Like, literally a limousine? No, limousine, the, the band. Oh, right. There's a yeah. band called Limousine. Like, I'm Larry. We're from the band Limousine. That guy. Why did I picture an actual limousine coming to hang out I... with them? Because limousines are cool. I guess. Did you like? Okay, because you, I was since you went to high school. Did were you in high school? Were, did you? Well, oh, that's right. You went to a Catholic high school. You probably didn't do anything cool like high school prom or bullshit like that, did you? Of course we did. We just couldn't have sex while we were dancing. I mean, you technically can't do that in public school either because well then there's not much of a difference then was there i guess not i mean did you where did you guys have your high school prom at john travolta's sex mansion in ocala Will you... <laughs> i'm not even kidding it was some place called jumbalair look it up this is a real place what? it's just it's a real fucking place well, i can't look it up i'm playing the game you gotta look it up and well, show me a picture i don't have to look up dick okay this is no, something you could the... do in your spare time okay no, look it up this right now is and a show real me. place i'm not doing anything right now uh, i'm focusing too much you're such a stick in the mud sometimes oh it's the field let's put the field on the map let's uh, that's good enough a uh, strong bad yeah actually let's no, let's put it more closer in front of, there we go. If you like, we'll, we'll, after this episode, I'll show it to you and you can confirm with the audience that I was right because they'll take your word against mine, of so course. Like, no, they wouldn't. No, I'm a so huge goober. <laughs> I feel like you're probably the one that people like to listen to more because you the have the much more pleasing voice. Nah. And your physical attractiveness is far greater than mine. Please. Yeah, they, they, they were lucky they didn't get to see that episode where you just decided to take off your clothes. I first of all, it was a shirt. Second of all, you were also in like I was wearing the clothes. I didn't. I didn't even strip down. Folks, you have absolutely no no idea how many episodes we've done where we've had to deal with the heat, and both of us have just been in very little clothing. And Maddie's just giving me the business over this right now. Unfair. Why are we at the field? Because we're, um, we're looking tired. around. We're putting shit on the map. Funny. I thought we had to Boy, fill out the contest form. Well, no. Okay, because whoever takes the coolest album art. Oh, picture, okay. Who's um, in the band, though? What? Who's in our band, though? I'm feeling it's going to be the usual suspects. The did cheat? You, well, of course, the cheat. Uh, did strong you see, set? Did you see the bass? No. Man, no, but he plays the bass. No, strong mad the plays the bass. Oh, you're right. I may have to raise taxes. Sorry, Tyre. <laughs> uh, these are all the various bands. I like it. I like the art. Yeah. Cool tapes. Uh, that's Marzipan's band, and also the Cheat and Strong Matter in it. Look, you gotta understand, it's a very small cast of characters, so, like, a lot of this shit is basically just the same people over and over again. What is oil? Ooh. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Aha. That looks ha. like a cool album cover. The make automobile is looking especially fearsome today. Hmm, that oil slick is new. Oh, Maybe it also ho, ho, ho. has smokescreen and missiles. Oh, there's the stick behind us. We'll get to it in a moment. Nice. Uh, yeah, let's put it between Bubs and Strong Bad, yeah. Uh, so, like, when you went to your prom, did you, like, with, like, your friends and your date or whatever, did you guys go in, like, a limousine? 
Yeah, yeah. Yeah, that's like a fairly common practice here, apparently. I uh, mean, I thought it was a little too over the top. Like, it seemed like such a whatever event for mm -hmm. somebody to decide, hey, let's feel like we're so cool and hip and, and rich because we're going to arrive in a limo. But, like, there was something trashy oh, no. about it. I couldn't put my finger on it. Because, oh, cool, I love the whale. Because it's a bunch of hormonal teenagers in an enclosed area. Yeah, I felt trash. <laughs> <laughs> like, I get... Like, I can... I, I, you I don't felt even have cheap. To, oh, shit. I, you don't even have to say anything. I'm just going to assume shenanigans went down in those limousines. I don't know. I don't think much even happened in the limo. I just remember I felt cheap. Like a did cheap perfume. Did shenanigans not happen in your limousine? I don't know. What would you consider shenanigans? I mean, typical teenager stuff with everybody all groping all on each other. <laughs> there was no groping. However, somebody <laughs> was very, it was very quiet because everybody was taking in the limo thing. I was just like, whatever, because it wasn't like my first time in a limo. But like, I guess I did think it was neat, but like, it just felt weird because I, I like the thought that it was just me and the date. But like, it was weird because there were a bunch of other dates in the limo. Oh. So we were like, whatever, like, hey, what's up? And it was really awkwardly quiet for a moment, but then all of a sudden, one dude, like, he looks kind of stoned already. And he oh just, boy. out of, like, a bag, he just pulls out, hey, guys, I brought a bottle of rum with me. Oh. So, everybody just decided to, like, already start getting drunk before we even arrived to the place. Oh, and that helps. Which wasn't a good idea, because we got checked by the school people the school faculty because they were all there well, at they the can't entrance. take the booze out of your system now can they i guess they can't but man did did some of them it was weird because it's like they couldn't do anything but they were like mad they were like mm, like what have you done where should we put the stick should we put it between the photo booth and marzipans or somewhere else put it up your ass i'm sorry put it next to the house Mar no okay. No, I meant, like, the our main house. Ah, whatever. Who cares? Oh, uh, did you talk to the whale? Yeah. You I missed it. I love the whale. You want me to go back and talk to it? Nah, it's fine. I could already assume. But I love that whale. <laughs> uh, all right, I think I guess it's my kinda, favorite landmark. We kind of filled out the map already. So... All right. Go to Marzi's house. No, hold on. Because you notice there's, like... A, uh, a an empty space here, right? Yeah, and that's we picked up we picked up a stencil. Oh, I it see like what you're saying. Yeah, and I mean we don't have spray paint per se, but we do have ew aerosol cheese. <laughs> that's gross. Now that's a spicy bit of graffiti. <laughs> Excuse me, is this the fabled fence where all the hipsters vanish? Oh my god, strong. The hipsters? The of their favorite bands? Why, yes. Yes, it is. Oh, good. I'm a snooty rock journalist looking for <laughs> the next big thing to be pretentious about. To be pretentious about. Well, naturally, since Love I that. was a huge shut in mm. in high school, I didn't go to my prom in a limousine. But I. Consider got yourself spared. I did. I do. I do. That was a terrible, like, awkward social situation for me. All right. Uh, is Strong Ted still here? Or yes, he is. And what's funny is I've avoided those social events for as long as I can remember. Like, I always re there was always homecoming, you know? Mm -hmm. And then there was prom at the end of the year. Mm -hmm. And I always avoided it. Like, I was dodging that, like, the Matrix, you know? I was dodging that so hard because I thought to myself, I'm too cool for this shit. But really, I was just like, I got better things to do. I don't need this. I don't need to be in a small, crowded area that's going to be all hot and sweaty, full of all these stupid teens. I can't deal with this. I'm not going to. So I avoided it all freshman, all sophomore, all junior. But then finally, finally, here comes senior year. Yeah. And everybody's ragging on my ass. We've never seen you at one of these events, Maddie. And I'm just like, man, go fuck off. Who gives a fuck? And they're like, you're going to regret it if you don't go at least once. You're going to regret it. You're going to go to college and you're going to regret that you didn't have a nice prom moment or a nice homecoming moment. And I was just like, all right, here, here. I'll go to the senior prom there. The last year, I'll go to the one prom there. You know? So I can yeah. say I did it once. 
It wasn't as bad. It was actually nice Security. because they spared out, they put a lot of money instead of some shitty space. They man. managed to rent out that John Travolta place. Which I promise you is a thing. I will show it to you now. <laughs> okay. Um, which was actually nice. It was a fancy place. So it was, you know, we're very well ventilated. Some nice air what conditioner. It? it wasn't hot. They had pretty good food. Uh -huh. I remember the food very check. well. You know, the so it was alright, but there were awkward moments, for sure. You can't fool me. Huh? You mm. don't think I'm cool enough to be a fan of that cool new security band that everyone's talking and vandalizing about. I kind of uh, wish yeah. I had a figurine exactly. of Strong Sad. You, you can. I can? I yeah, they still one. sell merch on the site. Yeah, good luck with that. Uh, that's These babies cute. were snatched up by all the hipsters weeks ago. No, no, no. I kind of oh. like Marzipan. I you can I also get one of Marzipan. I kind of want Code Z, but I shouldn't. Really? There's also Code Z. I don't think I should. You, can get, all, you can get all of them for pretty cheap. Not quite cheap as free, but... Hip what kind of what, do, what, what kind of remark is that? <laughs> Alright, so we, we totally got security now for the concert. Uh-huh, and I'm afraid we're going to have to end the episode. Oh, already? Yeah. yeah. Alright. Well, we're going to have to wait till this cutscene's over. Hey, security guy! Security guy. Is that what they call fans of security? <laughs> security? Well, hello yourself, security guy. No, dummy! That's what I call dummies who've signed up to run security in the <laughs> Battle of the Bands. Well, but Ouch. You're wearing my security jacket, ain't you? Yes, but... So take this billy club and get security. Oh, no, Strong's head with a okay. billy club. <laughs> nice. Awesome. Well, folks. Tomorrow on Geek Raiders. More Strong Bad. More reminiscing. More security work. Yeah. Yeah. Bye, folks. Bye.